Hey there, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany Bundles and today's video is going to be all about a new service or new feature, um, a new app that Shopify is offering. And this is going to be a useful app because a lot of times when I'm doing business consultations or when I'm answering emails or even comments, uh, a lot of people are asking, what apps do I recommend using to uh, remove background, um, like, like the background on pictures pretty much. And there are so many different apps out there that can help you remove the background off of your image. Um, I remember when I first launched my website back in 2013, um, I was using GoDaddy and um, I was trying to find a way to make my pictures look more appealing uh, for my website instead of them, um, like my hair or my products being laid on like a towel or a blanket. And, um, you know, although it's okay to have certain products laid on certain type of, uh, you know, materials, and uh, I've, I've even seen some really, really nice blankets um, as backgrounds as of, of recently. Um, and even, I think even like last year. So there's different ways to be creative to make sure that you do have a professional looking uh, background for your products. And there's also a way to make sure that you are keeping the theme and the fill of your website through your pictures. However, when I first got started, I was looking for different apps on how to remove background images. And I came across an app, I forget the name, but it was a little bit challenging for me to use because I had to have like a really, really steady hand to trace outside of the image, um, trace outside of the products. And for some, it would be really easy, but for me, it wasn't so easy. So this app is really cool because I'm going to show you towards the end of this video, a complete demonstration. So make sure that you're watching the entire video, but I'm going to show you how simple this app is. Is because you don't have to do all of that. Like you literally take the picture and the background, most of the background is removed. And I'm going to show you what I mean. Now I did play around with it a little bit off camera too. And there are some images that you may need to um, touch up to your preference, maybe using another app. However, this app is still a really cool app to have in your pocket. So on the screen, I'm showing you a image that. um, I'm showing you an image and an example of how this app works pretty much. Uh, so you can see the Rubik's Cube and you can see that it has a blue background. You can also see that it has a transparent background and that's pretty much how this app works. So you take a picture of your product. In this case, again, it's the Rubik's Cube and then the background is completely removed and you have the product in front of you. Now, like I mentioned, I am gonna do a live demonstration so that you can see using uh, one of my products from my website, badchickhair.com. The link is down below. Also, if you are not using Shopify, I strongly recommend you at least take a look at Shopify. Shopify constantly comes out with new innovative ways to help our businesses grow. And my opinion. I enjoy using Shopify. I've been using Shopify for a while now and um, I really love the analytics behind Shopify. I love all the different apps. I love all the, the different options and the functionality as a whole with Shopify and um, yeah so the link is down below as well if you do want to try out Shopify and there may even be a free trial. So I went over to the app so if you do want to download the app, it is available on iOS. I'm actually doing the demonstration from my iPhone, but this app is also available on Android devices as well. So the app name is Scratch Photos. So I went over to my app store and I downloaded it. And I'm going to show you a little bit of what the app looks like. So it does show that it can remove your backgrounds within seconds. And then I'm going to scroll over in just a moment so that you can see some of the other features and, and benefits that this app provides. So you can also change the background color for your needs. So like we just saw with the Rubik's Cube, and we are being shown that example again here, that you can have a transparent background or you can choose to add color to your background, whatever you want to do. But this is going to be huge. And also not even just thinking about your website and in terms of using um, this app strictly for your, your products and promotion, but there are uh, people that are uh, content creators as well and that are needing assistance with removing the backgrounds from some of their thumbnails. And so this app can be used with so many different uh, products and in so many different scenarios. 
And, um, you know, I really think that it's something to to definitely try, especially since it is available through Shopify. And if you're using Shopify, you know, why not take advantage of it? If you're not, why not take a look at Shopify and see what, what services they have? Um, so you can also use their shadow tool with the photos, and then you can go ahead and share your creation, share your pictures, your products with the rest of the world. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you all a live demonstration. So I went ahead and I pulled some bundles from my stash, uh, my inventory at badcheckhair.com. And um, I decided to use one bundle and lay it on my, my table to show you all how everything works. And so we can get a real live demonstration, like I mentioned, of how this app works. So it'll just be a few moments. Uh, before I get all of that set up while we're waiting for the bundle and you know everything uh, at this point I was going ahead and I was um, like setting up my uh, ring light and things like that trying to find the, the bundle that I wanted to use uh, take it out of its plastic um, baggy and things like that so just getting everything ready but this is what the app looks like it has an option for you to choose the camera so you can go ahead and take a picture or you can use your library. So this app also will have uh, the ability to pull up other pictures that you've already taken uh, to go ahead and remove the background from those images as well. So I like the fact that they give you both options. You don't have to take brand new pictures and you don't have to rely strictly on the pictures that you've already taken. You really do have an option uh, as to what's gonna work best for that certain scenario. And, and honestly, what your goal and what you're trying to, to, to have happen. Now, uh, like I mentioned a little bit ago in the beginning of the video, one thing that always uh, kind of got me with these certain apps is making sure that you trace outside of the product or trace outside of the person or trace outside or outline whatever image you're wanting to keep so that the background will be removed. Um, I just like the fact that this app kind of simplifies that so that I don't have to worry about tracing or anything like that. Again, some people are great, but it was something that I always struggled with. So here is a picture of my 12 inch body wave bundle and I turn my ring light on and just kind of wipe in away the surface. If there's any hair or anything left on it, kind of wanted to get it out the way, but I took a picture. The picture wasn't even the best picture that I could take. It was kind of shaky a little bit, but it still came out really, really good. So right now it's loading and the picture pops right up. So it pops up on the transparent background and I have an option if I want to adjust the lighting. If I don't, I have an option if I do want to take this image, save it and then go back over it with another app. So if I wanted to get a little bit more uh, defined or if I wanted to remove more from the picture or add more to the picture, there's always additional apps that I can add to uh, this picture once I go through this app. I also can change the background color. So I think that's really, really cool. I can add a shadow if I choose to. So I think this is really cool. Again, all the services and features that are available um, just makes me enjoy using Shopify even more. So again, if you do have an Android or if you're using iOS, uh, you can definitely download this app. To download the app, it was completely free. Um, I am going to show you towards the end of this video that if you do want to go ahead and save your picture, you will need to put in your email address, uh, which Shopify has my email address because I am using Shopify. So I'm not sure if you have to be signed up for a plan to use this app. I know you can download the app without having any association to Shopify, but when you put in your email address here, um, I don't know if it's going to prompt you to choose a plan or if it's something that would, would be completely, um, ultimately it's up to you, but I don't know if that's something that is uh, prompted before you're able to save your pictures. I'm not sure. But that is something that you can play around with and try. I mean, you can type in your email address and see. Um, I went ahead and just discarded the photo because I was using it for uh, just as a, an example and a demonstration. So I encourage you all to check out Scratch Photos and also to check out Shopify. If you do not have Shopify, again, it's not too late to switch over. Please click the link at the bottom uh, of this video in the description and choose the plan that's going to work best for you. There may be a free trial, like I mentioned before. Shopify has so many cool apps, so many cool features and great analytics 
for a lot of businesses, like a lot of businesses that I work with and consult have chosen to use Shopify and I have as well for all of the reasons that I just mentioned. So I really hope that you all enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.